It's recording, by the way. So, uh, you recorded it? Okay. You recorded it? Yeah, I recorded the entire thing. We're done. Everybody fixes themselves. What's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm here with David and Josh, my favorite childhood I star. never thought that this is how it would be, Corinna introducing a video. I know. What's up, guys? <laughs> I'm uh, very, up, I'm lacking in the view department, so I decided to call up my favorite Friends, Favorite kind, friends. Ki kind of friends, <laughs> and have them be in a YouTube video with me. Oh, Jason is also here, but he doesn't want to be in my shot. You know, hey. Hi guys, I'm off camera if you need anything, yes. just let me know. Baby. Um, I asked you guys some questions on Twitter, so we're going to answer some of those questions, and any other questions Jason's just going to ask us. We love us, it. We basically. love answering questions. Please, yeah. more, more. David and David Josh hate this that. right now, but I'm, I'm paying them under the table to do this. A lot of money. Okay. Mm -hmm. What is the biggest lie you've ever told? I, I say we should change it to each other. Like, have you ever told each other, like, a big lie? There's one time I had to walk to my elementary school for the first time and I had to do the walk all by myself and my parents weren't dropping me off and I was sobbing. What? Okay, keep going. What? Dave, the David show. Well, I thought you wanted- I thought it was gonna be like an interesting like vlog like lie that wow. you told. Wow, wow. Keep going. My story's not interesting? Alright, keep going. Uh, anyone with five million plus subs is interesting. I was- I, there was one day I was going to elementary school and my parents told me that I had to walk all by myself when normally they would drop me off and I was just sobbing on my entire walk over there and I cried to my parents that I wanted them to come and then everyone at school right before class started they were like, were you crying? And I was like, no, I have allergies. That was the biggest lie you've ever told? I don't know. That's Maybe not. so stupid. <laughs> I don't think I, I can't think of any lies that I've told. I don't Shut really up, think about it. Really? Watch like, this. I don't Turn know. How many guys have you hooked up with? Alright. <laughs> what about you, Josh? I want to know if you've ever lied to David and what you lied about. No, I mean, I haven't lied to David. There's nothing to lie. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing to lie about. Except like, you know, at 3 in the morning when I get a text from him going, Hey, want to FaceTime? And I'm like, no, I'm sleeping. <laughs> How do you FaceTime at 3 in the morning? Josh made that up. Anytime is a good time. Dude, okay. it's like, wait, let me just make sure it wasn't all a dream. <laughs> Josh, we're still friends, right? <laughs> Craziest fan experience. I'm gonna start off by saying mine. Okay, if you guys, I'm sure you guys saw this on Snapchat. <laughs> or on Working with David. On Twitter. I turned my psycho fan into my boss. <laughs> <laughs> Can I tell my story now? Yeah. <laughs> all right. Sorry. She so, cuts out all the other things. At playlist. Hey, sorry for the fucking funny part of the video. <laughs> <laughs> now, back to your regular scheduled boring. Corinna, go ahead. It's just, yeah. it's just Corinna's stories. We're all cut out. <laughs> Basically, at Playlist, this, nobody Nobody went to playlists except for me and a couple other people. None of these guys went to playlists. But I went to playlists and I tweeted basically I was in a fan's hotel room and we threw a huge party in a fan's hotel room. And oh, that I was, saw that. It, it was crazy. It was it was actually my craziest fan experience. So it was like a good crazy fan experience. And then experience. you slept with three of them. I did. I, three, it was actually four. Three lucky three, people. Yeah, four yeah. lucky people. <laughs> All right. Let's hear about your guys' favorite craziest fan experience. I'm dating. I'm dating mine. Liza? This is my biggest craziest fan. I, I don't know about crazy. I do remember once that I was um I was going to pick up tickets for this concert and there was like this big line of people and I'm like walking to this window and I really had to get tickets at this certain time. Damn, this is a story about me. It is. No. Wait, I, wait. No, it's not. Go, keep going. And this oh. girl was like, hey, can we get a photo like with with me and my friend and you really quick? And I was like, absolutely, just give me one second. I have to run and get these tickets. I will be right back and we will take the photo. And she immediately goes, Oh, well, you're just some asshole. <laughs> get out of here. Shut up. Like, how quickly they turn. Like, uh, I said I would be right back. Oh. Would you rather know when you're gonna die or die randomly? I'd rather die randomly. Die randomly. I'd like to know when so that like two months before I can start eating whatever I want. <laughs> two months left. Hello, chocolate chip but cookie. Even Josh, I feel like if I told you you're dying in five years, you'd already be like, I'm gonna start eating whatever I want because it's time to enjoy myself, you know? No. Yeah, you would. No. No. Well, I would Trust me, you don't know what it's like to grow up fat. <laughs> Keen or JC? I like them both. No, you have to pick one. You have to pick one. No, don't do that. They did that to Kean and he said, he said I was awful. All right, well, I'm picking Kean. I don't even know. I'll pick JC then, because you picked Kian. What do you think you pick? Oh, Kian. Duh. Oh, so hot, right? <laughs> who, are, who, are, who are you YouTubers? Oh, Kian. What was Josh, David, and Jason's first impression of Corinna and vice versa? Yeah. Yeah. Hi, I'm Corinna. Hi, I'm Corinna. Not a lot of people know this. Me and David met a really long time ago. We met when we both lived in the suburbs of Chicago. Yes. And we uh, met through a mutual friend. You say good things. Say and by things. mutual friend, she means his dad, because they were dating. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think I think I met her at a um, I met her at the Digi Tour. So a Jack like a, and Jack concert. Like a, so I think my first experience was, oh, she must really be into influencers. <laughs> yeah. And I was wrong. And I was right. What about you? <laughs> I actually, to be quite honest, I remember thinking I shouldn't like you, but I do. Uh -huh. 
Aww. Like, Aww. yeah. What'd you think about me? My first impression of you? Keep it short and sweet. This is all she does? <laughs> Aww. Aww. My first impression of... Myself? Was, of wow, myself. I'm looking. <laughs> was, bitch, I'm gonna make a lot of money. <laughs> my first impression of David was kind of starstruck because he was a Viner. No way. Like, a little bit, because I didn't know any, like, What's famous up? people. <laughs> he was also really dweeby looking because he had, like, braces. I've seen those vines. You were pretty so chubby. Cute. You seen those vines? Were you kind of chubby? Did you see my vines before you met me? Nope, but since I've known okay, you. So <laughs> and then Josh, like, wow, this is my first actually famous friend. So you didn't know about me Are we on friends? Vine at all? No, I know you. I know you. So, <laughs> <laughs> did you know me? You knew of me on Vine? Of course. Did you? Okay, can I talk? Yeah. <laughs> What's up? No, you didn't? Okay, stop. <laughs> sorry, sorry. And then Jason, I was really, I was actually a little bit starstruck. No, no, I was a little bit <laughs> jealous and maybe bitter because I was like, oh, like Jason's taking over being David. Do whatever the I want in the vlogs, you know? <laughs> so I was like, wow. I want to go on record in this video uh -huh. and say that I like your videos a lot and that you do do more than that. Once you started doing YouTube, I had got a lot more respect for you. That's wow. a real guy. And that's true. A lot more. And I like your videos a lot. That's true. He's, you. He's, he said a lot of nice things about Corona. Keep doing you. I'm a fan. Okay. Jason likes Corona. What's so your guys' thoughts? on Gabby's new song. I like it actually. So do I. Yeah. I like it a lot. Yeah, she actually played it for me, not telling me that it was her. Yeah, I'm and bummed out she couldn't do that to me. Expecting me to oh shit my God, on what it. If, and I was what like, if you, I like this. One member of the vlog squad has to leave. Who do you choose and why? Corinna. Mm -hmm. Oh shoot, I thought we were all just unanimous. All right, oh, okay. so you have to pick, <laughs> you have to no, pick let's do it again. one person one, beside. Two, three. Corinna. Corinna. Yeah. Now, um, Okay. This one's for you, David. Uh, what's your favorite Drake and Josh episode? Ooh, I like the um, I like the golden vest one the best. I've never seen that one. It's the best classic. one. It's just because the gold on the vest is something that I would want if I was working at. The Do movie. you know yeah. their lines to any of the episodes? It was still? Like, no, I mean you know I know all the, the catchphrases. Like uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say one of the catchphrases. It's not gonna be for Corinna. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Now you gotta give her one. All right, I'm sorry. Sorry. <laughs> 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 they <lived in> <laughs> Does pineapple belong on pizza? Yes. No. Really? Yeah, because that means it comes with ham usually, which I don't need. Oh. Yeah, I don't think. I love pineapple either. on pizza. I really, really dig it. The marinara and the pizza are really tying together. I don't like it. Sorry, the marinara and the pineapple. <laughs> Obviously, marinara and pizza tying together. You know what's the best? When you're like really hungry and someone brings a pizza with everything on it. Nah, and like, you're like meat I'm lovers. Do it. So I'm like, take it easy. No, not meat lovers. Garbage pizza. That's everything's on. Everything's on there. Like the veggies. Yeah, everything. Too much. It takes up too much real estate on the pizza and you then think? it bends and it gets like weirdly soggy like I like a nice cheese like crispy thin pizza name one youtuber that you are low-key a giant fan of or that you want to collab with that you haven't collab with mine's Shane Dawson I love Shane Dawson so much he's mine. like a better David Dobrik mine's Casey Neistat me too You've but you collab, you collab with, him. with him you have to pick someone else I have a lucky life what can I say <laughs> <laughs> True. who in this room would you want to be your baby daddy Wow, wow. Well, one has is basically married, one's married, and then... The other was married. Thanks a lot, Corinna. Well, I'm saying you're like my and dad, the other one's basically baby. dead. <laughs> the other one, and, and the other one can't oh. make a baby anymore. <laughs> I want you to be my baby granddaddy. <laughs> what does Dom taste like? Who can hold their breath the longest? Do you want to try? <laughs> you put it in the entire time. It's just a minute and 45 seconds of us. I'm like... <gasps> Would you rather have a head the size of a tennis ball or the size of a watermelon? Ooh, <laughs> that's kind of fun. Oh, the size of a watermelon. For sure. I'm going tennis ball. Would you Aww. rather Would you rather make love to Alex or Alex. Ryan Gosling? Alex. I would make love to Ryan Gosling. No, I would have to pick Alex. I'd let Ryan Gosling make love to me. Yeah. That's so much. Oh, out of respect, yes. 100%. Both of you, who is your favorite guy, like other male figure in the vlog? You have to pick. If you had, if you had to only vlog? make videos with one other person in the vlog, who would it be? I guess David. I'm picking Liza. I mean, I would, if I was straight on an island with someone, it'd be Liza. With no, you have to pick a guy. I'm saying, besides Liza, you have to pick a guy. Jason. Probably Jason. Chosen. I'd pick Big Nick. Really? Okay, come on. <laughs> smash or pass, Big Nick? If he let me smash. Pass. I'd smash. I'd be open to smashing. Uh, a little bit. Yeah. I'd, I'd smash it up. A little smash. Yeah. What was your favorite part about being on tour? Meeting everybody. I feel like that's cheesy though, but that's really like why I went. How much do you guys hate being here with me filming this? No, video? I kind of liked it. Really? Yeah, it was super. Chill. All right, let's do a whole other one. Oh no, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> Am I coming out with merch? Possibly. Okay, good. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you guys check out David's, Josh's, and Jason's channel. They will be linked in the description below. I hope you guys have a great rest of your week, and I will talk to you. I have. Wait, I hope. <laughs> All right, bye, guys. So clap for Corinna. Woo! That was our seventh outro. Corinna! Corinna! Josh? No, I won't. Drake and Josh is my favorite.
favorite childhood TV Mine show. Mine too. And I think it's and no, David too. It, no, I'm his biggest fan. <laughs> Don't so take I think that it's amazing you know that I'm girl. sitting down. Okay. Doing... You know you're my number one. Okay. You know you're my baby boy. Bye guys, we're gonna end it before Karuna tries to take my startup. I just wanted to say that I think it's unreal and super awesome that I get to film a video with Josh from Drake and Josh. Oh. Okay. All right, we're done now. I love oh, Drake and Josh, but I love Josh <laughs> and Drake <laughs> and Megan. Do the thumbnail. Peruvian puff peppers. Oh. <laughs>